not quite a bad view from the office. You see, Joseph Bertolozzi is a musician. You look at a bridge and you say, gee, I wonder what that sounds like. And the Mid-Hudson Bridge is his instrument. The suspension bridge has these suspender cables that run up and down. They're sort of like, they sound like bass guitar strings. Bertolozzi produced 11 songs using sounds from just the bridge itself. And for his follow-up CD, he set his sights on the Eiffel Tower. The original idea to play this bridge actually was to play the Eiffel Tower. Um, but I you know, quickly realized I don't speak French. I don't have any contacts in Paris. But with a public art project to show for and support from Congressman Hinchy, Bertolozzi decided to try to make his own connection. He sent a proposal to the mayor of Paris and the U.S. ambassador in France. They, they could have written back and said, you know, forget it or been there, done that, it's been done before, or they could not have written back at all. But they, um, they were serious about considering the proposal. The Mid-Hudson Bridge is made of steel and the Eiffel Tower was built with iron. And although the process for composing music on the structures will be the same, the sounds will be different. It's primarily made up of, of panels and tubing and spindles, and because it tapers, from the bottom, it's you know largest, of course, and goes up to the top. There should be a, a whole graded set of notes that you can choose from. Bertolozzi says he still finds himself explaining his project to people, and if he gets the chance to go to Paris, he'll have to figure out how to do that in another language. On the Mid-Hudson Bridge, Beth Krogan, YNN.